Hello everyone, this is Akansha. Welcome you all to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to introduce you the new coupling reaction which is a Buckwald and Hartwig amination which is also called as a Buckwald Hartwig cross coupling reaction and also called as a BHC coupling reaction. We have learned about the coupling reaction that involves the CC bond formation which is achieved by both homo and the hetero coupling. The twist in this reaction is that it is a coupling reaction but involves the formation of the CN bond. The Buckwell and Hartwig coupling reaction is a very important reaction in an organic chemistry for synthesis of the CN bond that is a carbon nitrogen bond via the help of the palladium catalyst. The reaction is named after the Stephens Buckwald and John Hartwig. Earlier the CN coupling reaction was reported first by Kosugi, Kimayama and Amigita in 1983. But there only the electronically neutral, sterically unhindered substrate have the good and the excellent in. Then in 1984, Bogger and the Panic reported an example of the palladium uh, which is in a zero oxidation state mediated CN bond formation. But the catalytic attempts were unsuccessful. Later on, the work started by Buckwald and Hartwig in 1990 and they proved the CN coupling by the palladium catalyst. Generally, we know that to promote a nucleophilic substitution at a vinylic or an aromatic center is a quite difficult. But by the use of the transition metal ions such as a palladium, it is possible. But the question is that how it is possible? This palladium that is uh, this catalyst which is used in the reaction which is, res which is responsible to draw the electron density towards the metal that leads to the activation of the aryl or a vinyl halide towards the attack by the nucleophile. And as a result the CN coupling is possible. The Buckwald and a Hartwig coupling is a palladium catalyzed synthesized of aryl amine where the starting materials are aryl halide or a triphalate. Here, here you can see the reaction scheme. The starting material is an aryl halide plus amine which undergo coupling in the presence of the palladium as a catalyst and a strong base. We get a couple product which is a amine. Here I use the word triphalate. Don't get confused with it. It is a trifluoromethyl sulfonate. It is a non-basic living group. So BHC coupling is essentially the cross coupling reaction of an aryl halide with an amine using the palladium as a catalyst and a strong base. Uh, the reaction has attained the global attention in organic chemistry as it involved the formation of the CN bond. Now these are the reaction condition where the various bases are used and also these are the various ligands are used in this reaction. Generally the sterically hindered ligands are used in the Buckwald and Hartwig amination reaction. L Let us know about the mechanism of this reaction. The first step is an oxidative addition. The first step that is an oxidative addition of aryl halide to the activated palladium complex result in the formation of the palladium complex where the palladium is in the plus 2 oxidation state. In this oxidative addition step, the oxidation state of the palladium is raised by 2. Here you can see that initially the palladium was in a zero oxidation state. After the oxidative addition of the aryl halide, the oxidation state is raised by Two. The second step is the replacement of the halide by the base. In this step, the halide is get replaced by the strong base. Here you can see this halide is get replaced by the base that is tertiary butoxide. The third step is the replacement of the base by the amine. Here the base replaces by the amine. Here the, uh, the, uh, initially the base react with the amine and form the soda amide strong base. This undergo reaction with this complex and here this base is get replaces by the amine. It is, it is a third step that is replacement of the base by the amine. Now the fourth step is the reductive elimination to form the product. In this step, the amine and a catalyst get re 
work get a mine is get form and the catalyst is get regenerated this step the metal in this step the metal ion is get removed and the new single bond form we call as an we can also call it in reverse of the oxidative addition here see the reductive elimination take place the catalyst is get regenerated and the new sigma bond is formed between these and we get a couple product and the catalyst is get regenerated this is overall mechanism of the buckwald and hartwig coupling reaction we will revise it the first step is an oxidative addition replacement of the halide by the base replacement of the base by the amide and last one is an reductive elimination now this is a same like all mechanism which we studied earlier but just this is arranged in a cyclic manner here we will again revise that mechanism the activated palladium catalyst undergo oxidative addition with a aryl halide we get a product where the oxidation state of the palladium is raised by 2 then after that amine coordination then uh, removal uh, of the halide by the base then later on reductive elimination the uh, catalyst is get regenerated and we get a couple product this is a overall mechanism but just represent in the cyclic manner and earlier we have learned in a step wise manner here i have explained some sort of example of the bhc coupling reaction the various compound can be make by this coupling the first example is a coupling of aryl halide with the amine in the presence of the palladium as a catalyst and a base we get a couple product um, in next example same like uh, earlier one where um, the palladium and the base is used and we get a couple product see here the nitrogen and carbon bond is get formed later on in this also this is also same example of the coupling of um, um, aryl halide with the amine in the presence of the base and palladium as a catalyst then we get a couple product in a second example you can see that the cn coupling is also shown by the aromatic heterocycling halide but for a but for this the hindered ligand is get used this is an aromatic heterocycling halide in the presence of the palladium as a catalyst and the amine and a strong base we get a couple product see here the nat carbon nitrogen bond is get form and this is also aromatic heterocycle and we get a couple product and lastly we can see this is also example of the coupling this is an amine this is a palladium as a catalyst this is an aryl halide in the presence of the base we get here the couple product last one is also same like that the bhc coupling this uh, this are all about the example of the bhc coupling uh, the bhc coupling has an various application in the natural product synthesis in pharmaceutical industries in various medicine as everywhere cn bond plays an important role well well this was all about the bhc coupling reaction which is a carbon hetero bond forming reaction very important reaction in the point of various competitive exams thank you for watching my video subscribe my channel for further updates and always enjoy the chemistry if any difficulty regarding this reaction you can post it on the comment thank you for watching it